Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Spoonie Pizzas here with another Pro Evolution Soccer 2019 video and today I am bringing you what I consider to be the best camera and also I'll be showing you the, those details in a minute but uh, just, uh, just let it run through for a few, few minutes just to show, you, show it off it feels and looks really really good you can see the whole pitch more or less we got a nice sort of broadcast the angle which will make the goals look a, a little bit even more well, even more special than we do and the controls feel nice and tight as well oh yes come on yeah that's great great start oh yeah so this is on Superstar. It's playing uh, Barcelona against Liverpool. Great header there by Dembele. Beautiful ball fed in from Rakitic. I'll be bringing another game in um, broadcast cam in full HDR. as well so you can share that off but yeah the controls feel really really tight here and uh, yeah I just like how you, the goals just look better as they go in as well because of that angle. Look, this pressure is relentless. Oh, almost, almost managed to get in there. Okay, I'll just share the camera angle now. Uh, so it's about 30, 30th minute. And there you go. A custom camera. Zoom zero. Height one. Angle ten. You can adjust the height if you want. You can play there. But I think one's the, probably the best. Gets you that little bit closer to the action when it's top of, near the top of the pitch. Two I find is a bit too high. So yeah, that's why I went for the one. That's the angle. That's just me. That makes it more broadcasty, so that's all gone for 10. And the zoom, yeah, again, don't want, I think like zoom one would chop off too much of the bottom of the pitch for me when it's at the top, so yeah, this is this is my optimal uh, camera angle for sure. Um, I will be testing uh, the broadcast cam out that's been suggested by one of, uh, I, think, I think he's one of my subscribers, uh, Jangov. Um, which I'll bring to you when the game drops. Test that out and see how that, see how that plays and feels. I really wish they would get rid of the, uh, the zoom on the broadcast angle, but I can still play with it as I'll show you. Ooh, good effort by Firmino. Uh, I will bring, bring you uh, a broadcast video. And I can play in when it does zoom in anyway, so it's not, it's not too bad actually. Uh, the controls do feel really, really tight. Um, it was a lot harder playing on the NASA patch because it was zoomed out, I found, and uh, that's nice for sure. Um, it was zoomed out, and what you find is that the controls were all over the show <laughs> because the camera angle was just wasn't well, looked great. You'd be pushing left on the, on the stick, and it would be going down on the actual game. And your your brain would be like, what? What's going on here? <laughs> so
So whilst the Nestle patch was great in my World Cup series, it was uh, I don't know what tactics I'm using. I'm using my Barcelona formation tactics. Oh. That's why you saw Sergio Roberto first of all got to get up with the play. Get this in. I'm, you may have noticed that I've stopped doing my tutorials for the time being because that's because I've heard the full game is a little bit different in areas, so. See, on the normal camera, I wouldn't have seen that pass. Oh, unless I was looking on the, uh, on the mini map, but even then you don't get a true, true idea of where he actually is. And the way he's facing, and you know, oh, that's nice. Nice. Oh, stop the goal line. Oh, Carius. Oh, just try a little cheeky flick to nick it around the Liverpool player. Didn't quite come off. Rakitic. So yeah, I, th I think this camera looks camera angle looks really good. Let me know what you think in the comments, guys. It'd be uh, good to get your sort of feedback whether you prefer it, you think it's worse, and uh, and test that out for yourselves. I think it's really really good though. Oh, beautiful! <laughs> I didn't know if that, didn't know if that piece of skill would really come off because I don't know if he's got it in his locker. But yeah, <laughs> I'll take that. Great double touch. Cheeky. Just drive towards the box. As soon as he gets that level with me. Step to the left, cuts inside on his right, on his third foot. There's a bit of a deflection there, but I'll take it. Nathaniel Klein. 2 0. Yeah, I, I really do like this uh, camera angle. Just feels great. Like the controls are, like I say, really, really tight. Spoonie, I'm going to call this a Spoonie cam. <laughs> so when people go ask me, I'll say, oh yeah, this is the, what camera angle is this? I'll say it's the Spoonie cam. And I'll link into this video. Do that. If I'm streaming, I'll show them in game. Come on, let's see. He's got loads of stamina. Oh, he's going to roast Van Dyke, who's got no stamina. A little bit of cheeky skill. Oh, my word. What a goal. I, did, I don't know if it would work, but sometimes you got to just try these things. Oh, my goodness. What a goal. <laughs> I saw Van Dyke had no stamina, so I was like, well, I'm going to just burn you. See you later. Oh, that's beautiful. Karis is like... What? What is this? What is this? Oh, yeah. Pez magic moment. <laughs> it's just the up from the other angle. Very quickly. Do you know that? Closer get to the door. Oh, look at that. He was just about to dive as well. He was just about to dive. <laughs> Salah's coming off. 
They've resigned to a 3 0 defeat. In this beautiful camera angle, there you go, ladies and gents. Wow, just showing off the camera angle and winning at the same time is is the best. So, yeah, let me know what you think in the comments, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video. Cheers, guys. Bye bye.